Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix Chicken Soup app not working on Roku. So first of all, you need to make sure you're running the latest version of the app. Press the home button on your Roku remote and then head over to the Chicken Soup app right over here. Once the app is highlighted, press the star button on your Roku remote to open the options menu. Now it's loading the channel information and then eventually it will pop up with a menu that gives you some options. We're gonna go up and click where it says check for updates to make sure you're running the latest version of the app. Once it's updated, check if it fixes the issue. But if you still encounter this issue, then you need to hard restart your Roku device. So the first step is to turn off your Roku device using the remote. Then unplug the power cable from the power outlet. Wait for three to five minutes and then plug the power cable back in and turn it back on. This should fix the issue, but if it doesn't, then you need to completely reinstall the Chicken Soup app. From the home screen, head over to the Chicken Soup app right over here. Once the app is highlighted, press the star button on your Roku remote and then click on remove channel from the pop-up menu. It's going to ask for confirmation. So click on remove to uninstall the app from your device. Once uninstalled, press the home button on your Roku remote. From here, we're just going to use our remote and scroll down until we get to where it says streaming channels and then click OK on your remote. Once you're on this screen, scroll down to search channels and type in the app name and it will then show up right over here. Scroll over to the right and then click OK on your remote. Then we're going to click OK on where it says add channel to install it back on your device. Well, that's how you fixed Chicken Soup app not working on Roku. I hope you found this video helpful. And if you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up to see more videos like this. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. We'll see you in the next one.